Today I'm going to be unboxing what I consider to be a very original product. Let's go into Camp 411 and take a look. In this video, I'm going to be doing a review for Antarctica. They have sent me things in the past to review and this is their newest product. And what this is, is an ax and knife throwing kit with a carrying case, which makes it super easy to travel around with. I thoroughly enjoyed the last set that they sent to me, but this one's most definitely new and improved, and we're gonna take it out of the box and get a look at it. It comes with three knives, three axes, and this comes with a sharpening stone. So let's get into the contents here. It comes with a sharpening stone, which I think is a very nice addition to something like this. You can keep the knives and the axes nice and sharp. All right, we're just gonna open up this case here. All right, so what we see first when we open this up is a set of throwing knives, and this is the, the knives that you get. I think these are gonna do very good in the area of no spin. If we open the package all the way, we've got these throwing axes. These feel like they've got some good weight to them. I know these are gonna throw very nicely. There are several things that come to mind when I see something like this. Number one, if you got somebody just getting into the sport, they want to throw knives and they want to throw axes. This is kind of a, a good all-in-one gift to give to someone. Uh, you can imagine wanting to get into this for the first time and then somebody handing you a gift that's got, you know, three throwing axes, three throwing knives in this beautiful case, which makes it very easy uh, to take around with you everywhere you go. Something like this kind of reaches the minimalist in me as well. I think it's pretty fascinating that you can pack so much entertainment in this small space. This runs about $55 on Amazon. And whenever I have the opportunity to do a product test or review, I try to do two things. I wanna be fair to the manufacturer, but I also wanna be straightforward with the viewer. And I gotta tell you that I think this is priced very fairly because I've gone out and done tons of price checks on throwing knife sets, on ax throwing sets, and a lot of times you're gonna pay anywhere from 25 to 30 bucks for a budget-friendly set of throwing axes, and you're gonna pay at least 10 to 20 bucks for a set of throwing knives like this. If you put all that together and then you provide a carrying case like this as well as a whetstone, you're well under what you would normally pay if you bought all of these things separately. All right, talk time is over for now. Let's get to work. All right, first we're gonna start with the throwing hatchets. I'm gonna get about two rotations out. I can already tell you these feel amazing. You know, a lot of little throwers like this that you get don't have a handle on them. And these have a really solid handle attached to them. And having a good handle helps you get some good leverage for a solid throw. I like the color of the handle too, and I'll tell you why. When you first get into this sport, you're not that accurate. You throw over the target. Sometimes you throw beyond it. And if you throw a black ax like this over in the leaves, you'll find out real quick how hard it is to find something like this. I've lost so many blades in my time of learning how to do this. It would have been nice to have some color sticking out at me. It's also really fun to do some double tapping with these types of throwers. throw beautifully from the side. So I'm 100% satisfied with these and I think you will be as well. I just feel like I've got good control with them and I feel like they have a solid weight and a good punch. Now it's time to take a look at the knobs. You know, when I look at these, I think no spin. They've got that aerodynamic feel to them. I think no spin is going to be better because when it comes to rotational throwing, you know, a knife like this doesn't give you a lot of control with regards to hammer grip positioning and all of that. But you know, here and here, I think we're gonna be able to have something to work with. I will demonstrate every kind of throw just to show you that these will be sufficient for whatever you wanna do. No spin first. I feel like those did pretty good. They're fairly light, but they're no lighter than your typical Smith & Wesson throwing knife, and I think they're reasonable for what this set offers. Now, again, you can do rotational throwing with these. I don't think this kind of knife allows you to get the right amount of control in my honest opinion. But what I do 
is I will typically pinch grip rotational throw a knife like this. A lot of power with the pinch grip rotational throwing on these. I will do an underhand rotational throw with my position like this. You can hold the tip here and get closer, maybe five, six feet away, and you can do a half spin throw. Be careful though, standing that close and throwing a knife like this. Something like this can bounce back. It's light, and the closer you are to the target, the more susceptible you are to being hit if this bounces back really quick. Throwing at half spin up close, just depending upon the knife, can put you at certain risk. So I wanna give these throwing knives a pass as well. I think they do good with no spin. I think they got enough weight to get the job done. They're lighter than what I normally use, but they're still good. And I think they go well with the set. So I'm super happy with this ax and knife throwing set from Antarctica, especially with the carrying case, the whetstone. I just think it's a great product for 55 bucks and really a great starter kit for anyone. So whether it's wanting to give someone a gift who's looking to get into this sport or just having the option to take throwing axes and knives around with you in the car or just any kind of throwing you like to do. I think this will meet your need and I appreciate you watching this video. I'd love to hear from you in the comments section. I will drop a link for you to go out to Amazon and pick one of these up if you're interested in getting it. And as always, thank you for your support. Take care.